Okay, so this is a real quick lesson, and this is um, something that I think is useful if you are, you know, like me, uh, you haven't had a lot of time lately to practice, but you need to, you know, obviously keep up, keep things going. Um, so one of the things I've been working on the last week is basically just spending about 15, 20 minutes doing this, playing a samba with the feet, so samba pattern, okay? Pulling out the old brushes, which I recommend. You can do this with sticks, but I think it's better for you to use the brushes if you can. If you don't have brushes, you probably need to get some. So what you're going to do is you're going to play paradiddles. We're going to play a couple different families of paradiddles, but paradiddle we're doing right now is just regular paradiddle. We're going to change the note value, and the note value is going to go from eighth notes like this. Okay. Sixteenth notes. Okay. And the thirty-second notes. It's nice because you hear where that's really falling with your feet. And then start switching up the different um, voices on the kit. So like. So you get the idea, right? You're just playing paradiddles as eighths, sixteenths, and thirty seconds over a samba. Okay? So spend some time with that. Move around the kit. Isolate one hand by playing one hand on a leg. And uh, I think it's a really good warm-up. So now we're going to look at inverted, paradid in inverted paradiddles. We'll do the same thing with the feet, but we're going to change up our paradiddle a little bit. Okay, so now we're going to look at uh, paradiddles, inverted paradiddles. So an inverted paradiddle, if you know a paradiddle is right, left, right, right, left, right, left, left. An inverted paradiddle puts the double in the middle, so that's right, left, left, right, left, right, right, left. So right, left, left, right, left, right, right, left. Okay, so it changes it slightly, all right? So the double's in the middle. And I like this one a lot. Um, I think it sounds pretty cool with this particular thing. So again, we get the eighth notes. And I think you should take your hand away on this one as well, right? So Okay, 30 seconds. Um, and then move around the kit. So remember the sticking again. Right, left, left, right, left, right, right, left. And it, you know, even though the 30-second note is obviously faster 
right? More notes in the beat versus an eighth note pattern. It's still, you know, you still got to get that. You still got to get that independence. Don't skip the eighth note part. Okay. Sixteenth notes. Thirty-second notes. Okay. Eighth, uh, eighth notes. Okay, so that's the inverted paradiddle, right? The open hi hat thing's pretty cool. Open handed hi hat thing, so you're going. Sixteenth notes. Okay, so that's that. That's that sticking. Right, left, left, right, left, right, right, left. Doubles in the middle. Samba on the feet. You play eighth notes, sixteenth notes, and thirty second notes. The last one we're going to do is the inverted, uh, I'm sorry, the reverse paradiddle. We just did the inverted paradiddle. Reverse paradiddle, where it's the doubles followed by the single. So right, right, left, right, left, left, right, left. This to me is the most difficult because it's starting with the double. So take your time with the last thing and then we'll move on to the next thing. Okay, so now we're on the last sticking and that is the uh, reverse paradiddle, right? And so that's where you're leading with the double. And this one has always um, given me fits and it's something like this oh I started with 16 so I apologize eighth notes and I can't emphasize how enough how important it is to do the eights okay because it's a balancing act right it's the it's all about placement against your feet. So this is like did a did a para, did a para, did a para, right? Because you're playing the double first. Isolate the hands. Ah, uh, sorry. Okay. Sixteen toes. Ah. Uh, Thirty second notes. It's 30 second notes. playing a fast samba, okay, because you, you, it's, it's really about loosening up, getting that mind working, where you have this ostinato, and you've got these different stickings, and different note values, right? Okay, so to recap, we did the paradiddle, right? Right, we 
did the inverted paradiddle, which is this. Oops, uh, yeah, it's, uh, yeah, that's right. 16th. That was the 30 seconds. And then the reverse paradiddle. Okay, so that's it. Again, you can spend three to five minutes on each one of these things. Paradiddle, inverted paradiddle, reverse paradiddle, but keep the feet going with the samba, right? One, yeah, two, okay. So that keeps those feet, you know, gets them warmed up. It's a nice physical, mental challenge. You notice I had the snare drum off when I was doing that because I wanted to hear the pop of the, uh, of the brush and didn't want the snares to get in the way of that. So take your time with it, have fun. I do think that if you're like me and you don't always have a lot of time to practice, this is a great way to just maintain, okay? Until next time, thanks for stopping by.